Doing a bit of cleaning for the guests, are we? No. No, my bloody mum has called and she's she's on her way down right now. And she always does this. She always does this. Just. No. Um, Jennifer's on her way down, is she? Well, well, who else am I talking about? My mum, yes, my mum. Hurry up, hurry up, grab me. come on. I was a little bit, a bit worried about like the guest and the subject today, you know. What? How do you mean? Well, it's like because like, this is NH, NHS thing, isn't it? We're doing. Yes, the NHS. It's controversial, isn't it? How is the NHS controversial, Marty? Well, people argue about it a lot, don't they? I saw it on the telly once, I think. Yeah. <clears throat> do you know what the NHS is, Marty? Women's National House Service or something, isn't it? Yeah, housing. Controversial. No. Marty, it's universal healthcare, okay? Oh, like the doctors, isn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. You, you, when you go to the hospital and you don't have to pay for it at the end, that's the NHS. Right. May have... I don't think I've got the guests quite right in that case for this week's show. Might be a bit... It'll be okay. Well, what, what did you tell them? I'm just something slightly different. But it'll be okay. It'll, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. It'll we be had a serious conversation about NHS cuts that are happening at the moment that are, are seriously impacting Britain. Well, I could do that bit then, because I got a cut, didn't I? I got a cut, and it would have been the NHS who helped me out. It's gonna be good. God, you're an idiot. How long um, till your mum's down then? Oh, any minute now, I guess. What? Oh, right, jolly good. Michael! Hello, Mum. Oh, Mom. it's been too long, son. Too yeah, long. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dear, what's this? I don't know whether I like that. It looks like a bit of bum fluff on your face. I think it's got mm. character to it. Oh, uh, yes, yeah. Oh, Martin! Hello, it's been a long time too. <laughs> Were you tidying up? Uh, uh, no, well, we... we... I'll, uh, I'll get, have you got any rubber gloves? I'll, I'll give you a hand. No, Mum, Mum, there's really no, no need. We've, we've already done the tidying up. Really? Oh. <clears throat> so how have you been, son? Uh, great, thank you. Uh, but, uh, you know, you really should call before you fly over here. Oh, well, I thought you, you just do have phones in Mallorca, don't well, you? Well, of course we do, darling, but I just thought I'd drop in on the off chance, you know. It was all rather spontaneous, actually. I wasn't even expecting to fly back to England, so... Uh, yeah. Anyway, it's lovely to see you. So, are we going to have some tea or something? Uh, yes, yes, tea. What I'll, have you got go planned? Um... Do with a bit of sweet round, actually. Has he got a dustpan and brush? I'll, 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 go, I'll go and get one. I'll, 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 I'll do that now. Oh look, there's the villa we were staying in. You can see the beach behind there, just behind those trees. It was lovely. Oh, there's your Uncle Bill, look, on the diving board. Wonderful pool. There was three of them. Pools, that is. But, 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 but you're definitely on your way though, aren't you? You are, you are on, on route, so to speak. You are good. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Just, you just keep on coming in this direction and that'll be fine. Yeah. No, let me put, yep. No. Oh, and there's Raymond. You remember Raymond, don't you? That's his second wife. Lovely girl she was. Much better than that first thing he was married to. Dreadful person she was. Oh, look, and there's me and Juan, one of the waiters. Do you, do, uh, do you speak to the locals much? Of... Oh, no. Oh, look, there's another one of me and Juan. Oh, that's a quite a nice shot. It looks really nice in those tight trousers. No. Oh. Oh. No, 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 you, 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 you can still make it. It'll be kind, it'll, it'll be good, you, you... It's, it, it, no, no, that kind of thing... It doesn't usually happen. Oh. 
Well, I'm, I'm sorry you feel that way. Okay, okay. Oh, there's another one of me and mine. Blimey, he's in lots of shots, isn't he? Oh, that's me sunbathing on the beach. Oh, and that's the, that's just round the corner. Yes, lovely view of the of, of the seafront, don't you think? You know, you really should come out and stay with us. You'd love it. Yes, Mum, but, uh, you know, I've got a show to run. Uh, and, and actually, there's, there's guests should be arriving soon uh, at oh. some point. Is... Oh, look, there we are in the bar. We're drinking cocktails there. Oh, look at that enormous chunk of sangria. Oh, look, and there's Warren again. <laughs> Hi, yes, it's Marty. Yes. I was just wondering, um, are you, are you busy about, like, now-ish kind of thing? Just wondered if you could want to do a slot on the show. <laughs> good. Yeah, yeah, right now you can come straight over. Excellent. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. How many right, times right, do I have to tell you, you the Illuminati hold the purse strings to the NHS to necessitate all the biggest and the purse of every organisation in this country? This makes no sense! Don't you understand? This wasn't supposed to be controversial. This is the NHS. How can anyone disagree with the NHS? Thank you. Thank you. What? You're just making irrelevant points. It's a about the medication of the NHS and then there's all one thing after the other conspiracy theories. It's you need to be in the NHS to theory. They hold the purse strings. Oh, How much of this do we now own compared to what we used to own? How much? How is this Tell even me. a topic no. of discussion? No. We're talking about the NHS and I'm trying to educate you into the fact that if you think that is the one area of our life which isn't dominated by the Illuminati, then there's something very wrong with you. What happened? Why, why have we got these guests on this show? Have I, I told you about Ron Politsky. What I don't understand is why you don't understand when it's perfectly understandable. Well, I am an understander. Why can't you get it through that head of yours? The Illuminati control everything. The royal family, the army, the navy, every church member of every religion you can begin, begin to think of. Why am I having to tell you this again? I've told you it so many uh, times. Uh, uh, why, I, I why, why? I thought we were what disagreeing on, on the NHS. Who? What? There wasn't any choice. I think the first one wasn't going to come along. I had oh, to phone somebody. Choice. Well, we had to have someone who knew something about the NHS. Why did you not him? Oh, well, he, all people. He claims to know about all of it, doesn't he? He said he knew about it. Some show you've got there, Michael. Well, I knew it was going to be bad, but I didn't realise the show was this bad. I mean, come on, for Christ's sake, you can't come and sit down to the whole thing when you're talking about the NHS and suddenly go off on a tangent about how the Illuminati or the whoever else controls all the drugs, for Christ's sake. I mean, come on, seriously. I mean, what kind of conspiracy theories do you bring to a show like this? For example, like, like, I, I, like as you know, I'm working as a nurse, and I'm like, I yeah. can see that your eyes are dilated and that you are on drugs. I mean, I'm not, I'm, I mean, everyone can do their own thing, but I really, really don't like people who take drugs and, like, take advantage of the NHS. Because that is what you're doing. You have to admit that's what you're doing. And there's other people that come to this place and do the exact same thing. Thing, and it just sickens me. Uh, it's like, what have you got to say about that? Like, I mean, your speeches, it's like you're, you're being impaired, and it's like you cannot concentrate and you cannot see how it all is without actually being clear of mind. Stop. One second. <sighs> One second. Whatever. You, you know what? If you make the wrong booking again, I'm gonna. Nick, I need you to deal with this, man. But he's not happy, dude. He's not happy. I, and I, I can't. Oh, I just. Oh. Yeah. You got high again, didn't you? Hey, <sighs> for goodness sake, just, just get out of here. Oh, we, oh, we're so trying to say, we're, we're totally on your side with this one. Well, um, you, it's all well good to say in that, isn't it? Well, he was I, talking absolute rubbish. You did a great job. Oh, uh, yeah, but I don't want praise for that. No, so you don't, everyone should be defending the NHS. It shouldn't be like a proud, thankful moment. I mean, well, thank you for that. I mean, I feel great for that, but it's not the point, is it? Such a good service. Yeah, yeah. So you're, yeah thank you for your service. Yeah. As well, as a, as a, well, thank you 
for that. But you can, you well, you must admit that the NHS is in such disarray. It's the worst healthcare system well, in the bloody that's planet. Exactly, that's exactly why we wanted to do the show is to highlight the problems that, that yeah, we have. They weren't exactly free, being highlighted. That's no. Do you know? I can't believe he's still living in this place. <laughs> <Yeah>. <sighs> Well, it's home sweet home, isn't it? Do you know, you've been very good to Michael. Thank you, Marty. Very thoughtful of you. He's a good lad, really. Oh, yeah, yes. Well, you know, we've always kind of stuck together. Well, you're kind of alike in some ways. I mean, personality traits. You don't look alike, but... I don't know, he's got your temperament somehow, I think. And now... For declining stocks, uh, Trump's sanctions affecting markets in China. Don't, don't know something's happening in China and Trump. China, yeah, weird. Uh, stock markets are declining and going down again. Don't know really what's happening, but they go up and down, don't they? That's up what down, stocks up do. Down, up down. Mm. Um, oh, um, so oh, but there is an increase in one product actually. You, you you're gonna like love this. Uh, cannabis, cannabis stock markets going Yay. up. Everything's going down, but cannabis is going up. Yeah. Getting high. Getting high. Yeah. Getting high. Yeah. And Coca Cola are getting in on the action. They're doing wow. something. Coke, cannabis, cannabis, Coke. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a great night out, I guess. Don't know. Anyway, mm -hmm. prices going up. Buy Coke, buy cannabis. Oh, do try and hurry up, Michael. We've got a reservation. I don't want to be late. Oh, I'm starving. I haven't eaten all day. Feeling a bit jet lagged, actually. Do you know, I'm glad I've got this opportunity to thank you for being so good to Michael. He needs a sort of a male role model. I mean, a good male role model. God knows his father wasn't much of one. Total arsehole. Don't know how I ended up with him. <laughs> Mind you, if I hadn't have ended up with him, I wouldn't have met you. <laughs> Do you remember that holiday we went on? Where was it? Oh, somewhere in Spain, not Mallorca, of course. Oh, and we had all that, um, what's that dreadful Spanish brandy we were drinking? God, we had about three bottles of it, didn't we? <laughs> God, we were hung over the next day. I don't remember much about that night, except I woke up with a smile on my face and a terrible headache. <laughs> oh, yes, happy days. Because you know Michael's your son, don't you? Oh, go see where he is. Thank you.